I wanted a place that hadn't been touched by the human hand. Something that was pure, that was raw. I think we need one big establishment in sure. the beginning, you know, maybe uh, over there or something, you know, like, you know, it's like where we stack is up. Beat number one, where are we going to play that? It's very rare that you can go anywhere in the world that hasn't been filmed, you know, nine times out of ten you can find a piece of gaffer tape or a camera mark on a rock somewhere and somebody's been there before. Tenerife gave us a virgin landscape. One Scorpio here, one Scorpio there, a second Scorpio comes here. This feels very open, it will make it feel more like it's a diamond shape. This movie decided to go somewhere where no other crew had been before for a very long time. And what you don't see today, I mean, what we're expecting to get is a, a sea of clouds. Being based on this island, I think they're taking advantage of the variety of locations that we have in one spot. One minute we're in the middle of nowhere and it's all the sea and the ocean and the rocks. Action. And then the next minute we're 8,000 feet up a volcano and it looks like we're on a different planet. Literally, it looks like we're on Mars. Wonderful landscapes. You'll never create shapes like these natural shapes that have been formed over you know, hundreds of thousands of years. We're up at seven and a half thousand feet at the moment and the top of the volcano stretches up to about 12,000 feet. So we're actually above the clouds. This desert exists because the clouds are beneath us. You're suffering from a lack of oxygen, so it's pretty tough on the crew. There's not much air up here because you get like a squeeze in your lungs. So even after the first take, you're just worn out. Get, 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 get. Water, please. Water. We're on the west coast of Africa, so we have the Saharan sun. It makes it very tough to shoot. Sword. Okay. Armor. 20% oxygen. It's a wonder I'm alive. We've got about six locations that we're actually shooting at on the island. We've always quipped that this island gave us a continent's worth of feel in a small island, and that was why we came here. You can go an hour uh, down, and you can sh find thick, thick forest that's uh, shot itself up through the lava. Then when we go down to the coast, we have the Mediterranean turquoise sea and the rugged cliff line. There was a shot that we had planned. It was the clouds rising over the mountain. And, and so we waited, we waited, waited, and one guy one day said, guys, it's coming, the clouds are coming, hurry up. Let's see when the gear comes in and when they... And we just wrapped everything. Yeah went there, put a crane, put a steady cam. I've been trying to get this cloud now for about a week. It's the last day of shooting in Tenerife and... Uh...